Hi, Eleanor. How are you? Hi, I'm good. Thanks. How are you doing? I'm doing wonderful. Thanks for coming on today. Eleanor, can you share a bit about your background and your health condition? Sure. Um, so I got married um, about six years ago, and we really wanted to start a family right off. Um, we had dated for 10 years prior, so oh, wow. this was always in our plans. Um, but we had a lot of trouble um, conceiving at first. And then once we would conceive, we would end up losing the baby. So we had several miscarriages and we we went through all the kind of like Western medicine stuff. Like we got checked out at the doctors. We went to IVF clinics and all the tests came back normal, um, saying yeah. that both of us perfectly normal. So, you know, we really don't know what's going on. So I started kind of delving into um, the more Eastern medicine, more holistic types of approaches. Um, and, you know, I found Dr. Wu on a uh, Facebook group and it's one, there was a mom that recommended him because her daughter had had trouble getting pregnant. And after four months of Dr. Wu's care, she was pregnant and she had the baby. So I contacted, account. yeah, and it was kind of a blessing. I mean, this was, it sounded like everything we were looking for. So I contacted Dr. Wu um, and I started drinking the um, herbal tea. Um, first, I had to send some pictures of my face and my tongue. And he kind of instantly diagnosed that, like I had a sluggish liver um, oh, you could tell that just from my face. Yeah. And he asked questions like, you know, are you sleeping regularly at night? And I said, well, gosh, no, I thought it was just sort of anxiety. And he was like, no, your, your, you know, your face is telling me something different. So he was able to kind of send me this tea that was tailored to what, um, my face was telling him was a problem. Right. And, um, we were pregnant, gosh, within, I think, within like five or six months of drinking the tea and it's incredible gave birth two months ago to our little oh boy. So. Congratulations. <laughs> that's you. amazing. Wow. Yeah. That's so it, it only took six months to make this happen. That's pretty amazing. Yeah. And we mm -hmm. had, I mean, we had tried for probably three or four years prior, like three to four years. The, what yeah. did, what did the other Western medicine doctors prescribe or how did they help you before? Yeah. So they, just, they did a lot of blood work and, you know, again, the results came back fine. They kept talking about putting me on these prescriptions, but when I looked into the prescriptions, there's always, of course, tons of side effects, you know, and I didn't want to delve into something that was going to cause other issues either immediately or later on. And some mm. of these prescriptions were kind of scary. You know, it says like could cause birth defects, you know, even <sighs> before they were, mm -hmm. the baby was conceived and it just, it kind of, I don't know, it turned me off and I was yeah. like, there has to be a better way. There has to be a, a, a different approach that's going to be better for my body and better for my baby. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I'm really happy that you found Dr. Wu. Well, what was your experience like with him overall? Like your it was amazing. Your experience. It, was, it was very efficient. Um, mm -hmm. It, you know, I'm a busy person. I work two jobs and oh, wow. I, you know, we wanted to have this, we've been saving up so we could have this child and I could stay at home for a little while. Um, and I was looking for something that would be efficient because I had tried all of these other things that took years out of my, our lives, mm -hmm. uh, that didn't get us anywhere. And so, you know, Dr. Wu was extremely kind. He was very personable. Um, the result was amazing. I mean, six months to get pregnant and yeah. have the baby. Like, that's just incredible. So right. it was you, really a godsend. <laughs> And you did the, was it the IVF before? Yeah. So, well, we had, yeah. So we had um, blood work done by IVF and we had like all these, you know, I had to have a surgery, um, like an egg retrieval surgery. And they were like, oh yeah, your eggs look great. You know, and his sperm was fine and all these different, you know, invasive procedures that 
you know, ended up not coming to fruition. And we did have an embryo um, made and inserted and that one, you know, it, it failed, unfortunately. Um, So, yeah, I mean, we tried a lot of different things (laughs) and seem to figure out, I don't know. It was, it's, I mean, I hate to say the word magic, but for us, it was magical. It really was. Yeah. Yeah. That's phenomenal. It's awesome to hear. I'm I'm sure there's many women that have been trying similar to you and they just don't know where to go. Um, But besides efficient, it was also pretty safe for you. Correct. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. I asked him too, you know, is this something that's going to, you know, are there side effects? Because that right. was another thing I had looked at with the Western medicine prescriptions. And he said, no, no side effects. He said, you know, you're going to sleep better. <laughs> you're yeah. going to feel better. You'll have more energy. Um, and, you know, it kind of helped. I don't know if it was directly related, but it kind of helped with some of my anxiety because. Oh, wow. That's interesting. We had a lot of, um, you know, we had a lot of trouble. And so having this, I just calmed me down a little. I felt like I was in good hands and I felt like I was on the right path. And it turns out I was, you know, we were right. (laughs) That's awesome. I mean, it sounds like you were able to really integrate this as a part of your entire lifestyle too. As you mentioned, it wasn't just about getting pregnant. It was also somewhat calming your entire nervous system with this herbal tea. Um, What other treatments did you do? Were there other treatments besides the herbal Um, tea? You know, I did some acupuncture, um, which he recommended too. He said that would always be helpful. Um, But that's really about it. I mean, I just, I had been eating healthy. Yeah. And I mean, the tea, I I drink it twice a day. Um, It's really easy to make, you know, it comes in a, easy powder form. So I could take it when I was traveling for work. Right. Um, Really simple and easy. Yeah. It's amazing that the simplicity of the Taoist Chinese medicine is there, but it's also very powerful because look at what it has delivered. And I think the audience don't really grasp that just yet. Mm -hmm. Um, Mm -hmm. That just yet. Mm -hmm. Um, Mm -hmm. What would you say to someone that is hesitant of trying TCM? I would say to just do it. I mean, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the adv- I mean, honestly, my advice would be to just jump into it. Just do it. There were no side effects. It was so simple and easy and it works. Like it was, yeah. it was a miracle, honestly. I mean, I'm an older mom, obviously. We started trying when I was 30 and yes. it, took, it took a while, but with his tea I mean with this kind of medicine it took six months so it really that's incredible and this is your first child it is yeah oh yeah Yeah. very very inspiring story so how do you feel today overall um you don't have any more anxiety obviously do you feel more hopeful that if you do go for a second child (laughs) Things will come along. Oh man. <laughs> well, I'm being eight weeks old. I don't know if we're on number two yet, but <laughs> yeah. Um, we'll wait for I a bit. Say, yeah. Um, I actually contacted him again um a few weeks ago and said, you know, is this tea safe for breastfeeding? Can I okay. get some more? So he's sending me some more. Um, that's kind of tailored towards me and um my baby he asked you know a lot of questions like is it a boy is it a girl so right. he really tailors the tea to our specific needs and and um, your body right your body type right. and your energy type yeah yeah exactly i mean i find it amazing that he spotted out your sluggish liver as yeah. the root cause i mean did that ever even enter your mind not at all i mean in I live a pretty healthy lifestyle, you know, I work out, I eat well, uh, the occasional pizza, of course, but (laughs) uh, Uh you know, I I never would have thought my liver was a problem. Like I don't, how would you even think that really, you know? Yeah. Yeah. And I mean, all the blood work, you know, came back fine, which is what the doctors were saying. So it was really kind of eye opening that he was able to spot diagnose. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, That is very interesting because he was able to spot that 
pretty quickly immediately and then you did all this blood work and they didn't see anything i didn't see anything nothing yeah all normal that's what Question we got all normal questionable <laughs> Yeah. Wow. What what an awesome story, Eleanor. Thank you so much for sharing this. Absolutely. So, lastly, do you have any words for Dr. Wu? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, <laughs> I would say I owe you my firstborn because that's how much it <laughs> me, I'm keeping him. So <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a big one. <laughs> that is a big one. No, we feel very grateful for Dr. Wu and um his work and I will be forever indebted to him. <laughs> oh, wow. Thank you so much for sharing, Eleanor. And we will have all the details of how to find Dr. Wu in the caption. Thanks so much.